This is my presentation entitled Apple Inc. by Jamar Taylor. Apple's Computer Inc. was founded on April 1, 1976 by college dropout Steve Jobs and Steve Wozniak, who brought to the new company a vision of changing the way people view computers. Jobs and Wozniak wanted to make computers small enough for people to have them in their homes or offices. Simply put, they wanted a computer that was user-friendly. Jobs and Wozniak started out building the Apple I in Jobs' garage and sold them without a monitor, keyboard, or casing, which they decided to add on in 1977. The Apple II revolutionized the computer industry with the introduction of the first ever color graphics. Sales jumped from 7.8 million in 1978 to 117 million in 1980, the year Apple went public. Apple Inc. has an organizational culture for creative innovation. The company's cultural features focus on maintaining a high level of innovation that involves creativity and a mindset that challenges conventions and standards. The business depends on cultural support and coherence, which are determinants of competitiveness and industry leadership, especially in addressing aggressive and rapid technological innovation and product development. The following are main characteristics of Apple's corporate culture. Apple has many of products that have paved the way for them and put them on the map along with services they provide with their products. With the latest Intel Core processors, MacBook Pro reaches new heights in compute performance. The 15-inch model now features a 9th generation 8-core Intel Core i9 processor that reaches turbo boost speeds up to 5.0 GHz. Faster than ever, iMac is now equipped with 8th and 9th generation Intel Core processors and the latest in high performance graphic options. MacBook Air features a brilliant retina display with True Tone technology, Touch ID, the latest generation keyboard, and a forced touch trackpad. The iconic wedge is created from 100% Recycled aluminum, making it the greenest Mac ever. The new iMac takes that idea to the next level, giving you even more amazing tools to do just about anything. iMac is packed with the latest processors, faster memory, and phenomenal graphics. All coming to life on the brightest, most vibrant retina display ever on a Mac. It's the total package powered up. With iPad, getting work done is all hustle and no hassle. You can easily edit a document while researching something on the web and making a FaceTime call to a colleague at the same time. Manage all your files in one convenient spot with the Files app. A transformative triple camera system that adds tons of capability without complexity. An unprecedented leap in battery life and a mind-blowing chip that doubles down on machine learning and pushes the boundaries of what a smartphone can do. Welcome to the first iPhone powerful enough to be called Pro. Monitor your health, track your workouts, get the motivation you need to achieve your fitness goals, and stay connected to the people and information you care about. With Apple Watch Series, you can do all right from your wrist. Apple TV 4K lets you watch movies and shows in amazing 4K HDR and with Dolby Atmos sound. It has great content from apps like Amazon Prime Video, Netflix, and ESPN. And coming November 1st, original stories premiere on Apple TV+. Plus. You can use Siri to control it all with just your voice. And now Apple TV 4K is even easier to enjoy a re-imaged home screen and new experiences designed to make TV more immersive and personal. $9.99 a month after free trial, no commitment, plan automatically renews after trial until cancel. You can download music, stream music, create playlists, family share. Apple Music is considered a top music retailer. Apple is arguably one of the most transformative 
companies today. From the first Apple computer in 1976 to the 2016 iPhone 7, the company has been consistently moving forward. The company has founder and former CEO Steve Jobs, who died in 2011, to thank. The number one reason Apple has seen such extraordinary success, according to a growth strategy consultant, considered a history of innovation. With Apple first went public in 1980, it was worth about $100 million under the leadership of Jobs, who left Apple in 1985. When he rejoined in 1997, he faced the task of restructuring an organization that was on the brink of bankruptcy. With CEO Tim Cook at the helm, the company is worth $750 billion and is swiftly approaching a valuation of $1 trillion. Apple has adapted to advanced features and capabilities of its products and services as basis of The list of innovations introduced by Apple include, but not limited to, the introduction of the iPad, the first device of its kind that stored thousands of songs with simple shelf capabilities through songs, development Macintosh, the first computer to use graphical user interface, and the launch of the iMac that ripped up the computer design rulebook. First mover advantage is another element of Apple's competitive advantage. It has to be stated that Apple's competitive advantage may be challenging to be sustained for long-term perspective. Specifically, the management may fail in terms of ensuring the addition of innovative features and capabilities in new versions of its products, thus compromising its competitive advantage. Apple's business strategy can be characterized as vertical integration in a way that the company has advanced expertise in software, hardware, and services at the same time. Apple's vertical integration is one of the major factors that set it apart from the competition. Apple's business strategy is transitioning from relying on the iPhone sales to prioritizing its services businesses and other divisions. John Giandria has been promoted to a machine learning and AI role. Retail chief Angela Adherence recently left the company and Bill Stazer has been removed of head of Siri. Our goal in a nutshell is to obtain stellar products and services within tight time frames at a cost that represents the best possible value to our customers. These are my references and thank you for watching.